Hey guys, it's the Garbage Bin's Two Wheels here with you on a Sunday of all days. But even Sundays, garbage men and garbage ladies work, okay? This is a little bit different type of work. But while I'm here with the rear load, I kind of want to show you exactly what the rear load does from the back and what we do from the back. Now, I'm a driver, I have a CDL, okay, CDL A license, but a lot of times I have work back here. But we do have employees that are designated to work back here. And they do ride on the step while holding the bar here, okay? And they ride on this, you don't want to do one leg. Even though you get used to it, and you'll see them doing that, mostly because the rest is really hard on your feet. But you want to be safe, you want to be secure, hold on. Snow speeds above, I think it's 20 miles per hour, am I correct? Yes, sir. 20 miles per hour. So you're holding on here, you're resting here. The truck will come to a stop, drive will get off, still holding. Walk over, you're gonna grab the can, you're gonna bring the can over here, put it by the tipper. Now the tipper, I have the truck off so you can hear me better. So try to imagine, along with my imagination, working together, I'm gonna to show you exactly what to do. Now the can is over here. Come over here. You're gonna pull this up. The can has a lip right here that's gonna to connect to this. The can's then gonna dump into the hopper. Once the trash is in the hopper, now you can probably get about two to three to four cans in here, depending how full they are. And a lot of times when the hopper is too filled up, you'll see throwers, you'll see them grab the can and they'll dump it in here to get it farther up. Once your hopper is full, and this is still while the truck is stopped. This isn't while the truck is moving, it's each stop. So you usually go to two to three stops before the hopper is full. Then once the truck is full, your lever is right here that you're gonna use. One is to bring, the blade will be up. The hopper will be completely, completely empty. The blade will be up. You're gonna pull this lever down, excuse me. Pull this lever down. It's gonna bring the blade down on the trash like this. And then you're gonna push the blade down. The blade's gonna curl in and take the trash or the recycle, whatever you're doing that day, inside the truck's belly. This is the truck's belly right here. And a truck this size, it's not a really big, big uh, rear loader. A truck this size, you're probably looking about eight, eight to 10. Am I thinking eight to 10 ton, you think on that? Uh, this one will do easy 10 tons if okay. you're packing it. Okay. As long as you're packing good, it, you easily and easy too, 10, maybe even over, yeah. if the trash is wet. That's when it really packs the best, yeah. really smashes in there. So once your truck is filled up, let me show you guys, come follow me. This is how you really will know where your truck stands. You're gonna look back here. Now this truck is empty right now, but once this part of the blade is all the way back here, your truck is full. Okay, right now the truck is empty, it's already been dumped. We won't use this truck today, let me show you what we're doing over here. If you look over here guys, we got roll off trucks coming. This is a community dump right now. So they, we do this once a year here in this community. People will bring things, yard waste, people will take furniture, things they don't want anymore. Twice they get- Twice a year. Twice, okay, twice a year, excuse me, twice a year. We dump it, we get a roll off truck here, we pick the cans up and then we go dump it in the landfill. I just want to show you that this guy, uh, show you all this stuff, guys. And I know I really haven't really demonstrated enough. I hope that was a good demonstration. This is the Garbage Men's Two Wheels. If you haven't, go ahead, like, comment, subscribe, and we'll see you in the next video.